Hello and welcome to another video exploring some possible questions coming up in the transfer test and looking to help kids uh, prepare for that test. For this one we're looking at a right angle triangle and it's asking some questions around some statements that are given there as fact and you have to basically choose which ones are correct. So when you read the question carefully and that's always very important it says stick Tick the statements that are true. So it's maybe potentially looking for more than one. It may just be one, um, but be careful. It's not just a case of find one question that's, or find one statement that's true and then that's the answer. It could be more than one. For this, for the purposes of this, I'm going to um, label these. So one, two, three. I'm just labeling so we know what we're talking about and what we're referring to. So number one, angle A, and angle B add up to B a 180. So we know that all internal angles, internal angles of a triangle equal 180. So that is the sum of all of the internal angles, including the third one, as it is in this particular case. So we've got this right angle triangle down here. So because we have a 90 degree angle going on, we know that it's not possible for A and B to add up with the right angle triangle to be 180. So we can say that one can't be true. Number two, angle A and angle B are both acute. So for this, you need to know what an acute angle is. An acute angle is something between zero and 90 degrees. So we've got a 90 degree right angle and your acute will fall somewhere between this. Anywhere between that. So once you understand what, it, what acute means, then this question is quite straightforward. So for B, we can see that the B falls between the zero and the 90. And if we put a, if we put a, a, a square onto the A, we can see that that is also um, the case. So we can say that that one is correct. We've got number three, A and B, angle B add to make 90. Well, if we know that the sum of all the internal angles is 180, and we take away what we have here, which is the, the right angle, if we take that away, which is the 90, we get 90. So therefore we can deduce that A plus B do actually add up to 90 and that is in fact correct. So there you have it, easy when you know how, which I think is the case in all of these situations. Like and subscribe if you want to hear of more videos and I hope that helps and I look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you.